Hi, One Hour Smart Home here, and today we are going to show you how to program your Lutron Maestro dimmer switch. So we've got the Lutron Maestro installed here, and you might want to program your Lutron Maestro dimmer because maybe you're getting flickering bulbs, or maybe you're not getting the full range of dimming out of this dimmer switch. So this has a lot of capability. It will work with LEDs, CFLs, and incandescent lights, but programming it is the fine adjustment that is gonna get this light and this light switch get the most out of it in the combination. So what we're gonna to do to program it is very simple. You're gonna go ahead and just click this button here in this top dimming adjustment and hold them down, okay? We're gonna hold them down for like five seconds until the indicator light on the side of the Lutron Maestro starts to blink. Okay, so we have got that blinking. Now what you're gonna do is you've got this toggle here. You wanna click the bottom toggle till this adjustment light goes all the way down to the bottom. Okay, now that is setting the bottom end of the range for your light. If your light is not flickering here, you can just go ahead and be done. If your light is still flickering, you can adjust where the bottom level of that dimmer switch is set by clicking the toggle up. You may click it once, twice, three times, 10 times, whatever it is to stop your light from flickering. And then once you're done with that, you can just program. So to save the setting, I'm just gonna say that my light here is flickering and I need to stop it and it takes three clicks. So I'm gonna go one, two, three, okay? And the light has stopped flickering. Now, all I have to do is tap here to save the setting, and I'm gonna tap twice again. I'm gonna tap once now, and that's gonna turn off the light bulbs, and then I'm gonna turn off one more time, or turn on, and that will save the setting, get me out of the programming process, and I am done. Now, if I want to program it again, I didn't get the right setting, I can go through those steps again, but what I recommend is you take the dimmer all the way down and you see where you get it and where it is adjusted to make sure that it is no longer flickering. And what I found is that I can get this all the way to probably one or 2% dimming and still have full range dimming without any flickering by adding the program to the Lutron Maestro dimmer switch. So let's say I didn't get where I wanted to go. I just go through those steps again to program this dimmer. I go ahead and I hold these down for, let's say three to five seconds until the indicator light starts blinking. Okay, and then I click all the way down so that I am at the bottom of the dimming range. If it's where I want it, I would just tap this once, twice, three times. If it's not, I'm gonna adjust this again. And instead of three clicks, I'm gonna go, let's say five clicks up. One, two, three, four, five, six whatever, I did six instead of five clicks, but wherever your lights are where you want at the bottom range, that's what you need to do. Whether it's flickering or you just don't want them to get that dim, that's what you're gonna do. You're gonna click until you get it to the desired lower level. And then you just tap once to save the setting. And then once again to kind of turn off the lights and one more time to turn them on. And that gets you out of the settings for the light. It gets you out of the Lutron Maestro dimming programming settings. And you can go ahead and test and see where that bottom level is for your light. Now, another nice thing about these light switches is that if you are changing a light bulb, you can go ahead and just pull this right here. And that will disconnect the circuit inside the light switch so you don't have power going to your light bulb anymore, just to make it safer for your uh, installation. Now, sometimes like a kid or somebody will pull these out or somebody changing a light bulb and then they won't put it back in and people are like, why is my light switch not working? Well, all you have to do is push it back in and then you're going to have power to the dimmer switch again. So just another important feature to know. Uh, to turn on and off the lights, you just click right here in the center and then to adjust the lights, you click on these over on this side, uh, up for more light, down for less light. And just an interesting feature most people don't know is double tap and it will get you all the way to the top light setting for the Lutron Maestro dimmer. So if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. Please subscribe. We also have courses and links to courses that we run if you want to support us or support this channel or click on any of the links below. You can visit us at onehoursmarthome.com. And once again, thank you for watching. We hope this was helpful. Please leave a comment if you've got any questions. 
and thanks again.